Hello guys, today we're gonna show you how to repair ice buildup in Samsung refrigerator. A lot of people has been complaining they are getting ice buildup on the refrigerator side like this and ice buildup on the ice maker like this. So in this video, we're gonna show you how to repair these two issues. Now, I really believe that the reason why this is happening in Samsung refrigerators is the cabinet start getting deformation, it sinks in and then it start getting condensation on the refrigerator, evaporator and on the ice maker. The reason why it's forming ice on the ice maker is because they didn't seal the ice maker box all the way around like I show in this picture. And the reason why it's forming ice on the refrigerator side, which is behind the panel, is because in the back of the evaporator coils has sink in, so it gets deformed, and that's the reason why hot air gets where it's not supposed to, it creates condensation, and then end up forming a block of ice. Now, I have a long video in my YouTube channel on how to repair this issue, step by step and it's actually four steps that you have to take the first thing you gotta try is replace the thermistor and seal the ice maker box now for you to do that you need to let the refrigerator throw out defrost the whole refrigerator disconnect the refrigerator for 24 hours with the doors open or disconnect the refrigerator for 48 hours with the doors closed so in conclusion you need to defrost the whole refrigerator to be able to do this repair because otherwise you're gonna run into a lot of trouble like I'm gonna show you in the video that I have to force defrost the refrigerator to be able to perform this repair because you know i'm a technician and i have to be in and out right quick but in this case this repair i have to return like four times until i got it right now normally when you replace the thermistor and you seal the ice maker box that's all you gotta do and that should fix your problem then the second step according to the manufacturing you have to replace the ice maker and replace the refrigerator panel i did that and i still got ice forming on the refrigerator side then a lot of people told me to try step three which is put a foam or some kind of insulation around the tubing where the ice is being accumulated and that didn't work at all so step three don't even try it because it gets too messy i don't recommend anybody to do that step and then step number four which is the one really works for me which is install a heater an aftermarket heater they sell on amazon or samsung came up with a part by samsung and you can install that part as well and i'm going to go ahead and link that one in the description of the video as well so if you want to fix your samsung refrigerator the right way and you don't want to deal with more build up ice on the refrigerator side or the ice maker go ahead and click the link in the description of this video or click the link on the comment section thanks for watching